The following is a brief guide on using the navigation function. Before you are able to access the navigation function, you must read and accept the conditions. Once you accept the conditions, the map screen will launch. This image indicates distance to and direction of next turn. This image indicates the distance to your final destination. This display contains the time, your current speed, and a compass. This image shows GPS strength and also is a button that you can press to access the quick menu option. This image shows the posted speed limit if enabled, the name of the next street you are going to turn on. This button can be pressed to switch between the viewing modes. This button opens the detour screen which offers two ways of modifying your route. This feature allows you to touch anywhere on the screen and set it as your destination. Press to open or close the screen adjustment buttons. You can also access the screen adjustment buttons by touching anywhere on the screen. The screen adjustment buttons will pop up immediately. You can then adjust viewing position. Rotate left or right adjustment for 3D view. Tilt up or down adjustment for 3D view. Zooms the map view in and out. Zoom preset buttons. When pressed, Smart Zoom will automatically return screen to current GPS position. Current street and house numbers. Opens the cursor menu. Press to open navigation menu. From the navigation menu, you can create and manage your route as well as change the settings on your unit. To find a destination, press Find. To find a destination by its address, press Find Address. A screen will pop up which requires you to enter information. Touch each line to fill it in. Start typing each letter of the city. A Select City screen will appear showing a list of cities that match your selection. Touch the city you desire. Repeat steps for the street and house number. After you enter the house number, press Done and it will automatically take you to the map screen. Select Set as Destination and your route will be displayed. To find a point of interest, press Find POI. To find a point of interest by address, press Around Address. A screen will pop up requiring you to fill in information. Touch each line to access the keyboard and fill it in. After you finish entering the house number, press Done and it will automatically take you to a list of POI groups. Select the type of point of interest you are looking for. Then go through the selection process until you get to the place you are looking for. If there is more than one nearby location for the listing you have selected, a list will pop up with all of them. Select the location you desire to get additional information. Press Select to display on map. Select Set as Destination and your route will be displayed. To find a point of interest by a cursor or location you have selected, press Around Cursor. Touch anywhere on the screen to place your cursor. Once your cursor is in place, press OK. You can then go through the same selection process as shown for searching by address, or you can search by keyword by pressing Search. 
type in the keyword, then press Done. The screen will display all matching results. Select the location you desire to get additional information. Press Select to display on map. Select Set as Destination and your route will be displayed. You can also select a point of interest by your current satellite location by pressing Around GPS Position. A list of point of interest groups will pop up. Select the group and then the subgroup if required. Or you can search by keyword by pressing Search. Once you go through one of the searching methods, a list will pop up with the results. Select the location you desire. Additional information about your selection will pop up. Press Select to display on map. Press Set as Destination and your route will be displayed. You can also search for a point of interest around your final destination or along your current route. The steps for each are the same as the steps for locating a point of interest around GPS position. You can view your route history by pressing History. A list of your previous routes will pop up and you can repeat any of the routes by touching the desired selection. Select Set as Destination and your route will be displayed. You also have a Favorites list where you can save routes so that they are easily accessible. Press Favorites to access list. You can then select any of your saved favorites to become your destination by short pressing the desired button. Select Set as Destination and your route will be displayed. You can edit, save, cancel, or view information for a route in progress by pressing Route. You can also organize or select saved routes or point of interests by pressing Manage. To set preferences for navigation, press Settings. Page 1 of the Settings menu will pop up immediately. Press Map Screen to fine-tune the appearance and content of the map screen. Press Navigation to control how Rosen Navigation System operates during navigation. Press Route Planning to control how routes are calculated and what types of roads will be used. Press Regional to control what language, measurement units, and time and date format will be used. To access page 2 of the Settings menu, press the right arrow button. Page 2 of the Settings menu will pop up immediately. Press Menu to modify the look and behavior of the menu screens. Press TMC to connect to TMC Receiver, Optional Equipment. Press Warnings to enable or disable warnings. Press About to obtain information on maps and licenses included with your navigation system. While in any of the navigation screens, you can press the left arrow button to go back to the navigation menu. If you press and hold the left arrow button, it will jump back to the map screen. Please see the owner's manual for additional information on the navigation function.